So today I would like to speak about high frequency. People ask me questions about what is high frequency, what is spiritual energy, what is radi radiation. Well, it is true that it's very difficult to speak about these um, phenomena because most of the people are not aware of themselves. They are not aligned with the um, high dimensions, dimensions of self and so, or existence. And so all of these um, sort of ideas or expressions remain kind of unknown. And it is fine because spirituality has to be known through experience. It shouldn't be something that we speculate about or we just take for belief. So when we understand that spirituality is the experience, we stop chasing theories and someone else's, you know, understanding. Yet, we can always listen to, and perhaps on this channel, if you are familiar with this channel and the knowledge that has been pouring through this channel, that this channel is dedicated to offering and sharing the actual experience. But again, we cannot experience something that is not within ourselves. So we have to be tuned or at least have access to a certain degree within ourselves to this frequency so that we can relate to it, so that we can understand it, so that we can literally experience it directly, even to a moment. And so when we, when we deal with spirituality, we have to work within, we have to focus within, we have to deal with our own experience. If at the moment our experience is trauma, if at the moment our experience is restlessness and anxiety, we have to deal with it. If our, if our current reality is pain, we have to focus on pain because whatever we experience in the current reality is the clue, is the door, is the pathway to our liberation from it. And the same applies to any aspect of our life, including spirituality. If we want to know something, we have to become open within ourselves to that frequency. We have to start contemplating. When we contemplate, we open ourselves up to that frequency so that we create a connection with that space, dimension, or frequency of knowledge, whatever you call it. Again, high frequency is something that cannot be explained. And it is not something that is static or final. The more we are aware of ourselves, the more we become aware of ourselves through the process of self-refinement, letting go, dissolution of corruption and distortions and whatever current pa patterns, the more we become aware of ourselves. To become aware of ourselves is simply becoming aware of that unconditional reality of the self that you perceive in silence, that contentment, that bliss, that beauty, that love, the frequency of love is the high frequency. But it always deepens that the deeper we know ourselves, or in other words, the more we let go of our unrefined, limited paradigm of self, the more we are connected and aligned with that higher frequency and the more we allow it to permeate through our own limited existence, the more we allow it to enlighten our limited existence, our limited consciousness pathway and this way we evolve. So there is no other evolution but the cultivation of higher frequency. But before we start cultivating anything, we are to awaken to it. The whole point of spiritual awakening is to to become aware of this higher frequency, to register, to mentally register, to register it physically, because it's not just mental or intellectual registration. It's the sort of this moment of yoga, moment when you plunge into this frequency and it permeates your entire being. 
once you registered, became aware of that, you may start cultivating it. It means you may start bringing your focus into it. And so you can only cultivate it by remaining consciously in the body and being aware of this frequency in the body. Then this frequency will transform your body. Then this frequency will transform your physical flesh, but making it healthier, but making it um, uh, radiating that, that purity by dissolving uh, limitations, corruption, uh, falsehood, and disease. And so when you discover this path, you discover the path of the higher frequency. When you are aware, and this awareness heals you, this awareness transforms you, this awareness liberates you from the limited paradigms of the self. And this is the point of higher frequency. This is the only way we can understand. And the point is not to understand it intellectually, emotionally, mentally, but to realize it within us, the direct experience, the direct transmission of that higher frequency through your individual mind consciousness awareness in your individual body. And the more you become aware, the more you know. But again, it's not just about expanding the awareness and knowing. It's about aligning this higher frequency, this higher awareness with your physical being so that the physical being may transform and eventually dissolve into that higher frequency. Thank you.